everyone. Today we're going to talk about the fact no country flag uses only black and white. And we have a theory as to why this is the case. We'll reveal our theory later in the video. There are quite a few flags that use both black and white, but in all of these cases, there's at least one other color. For example, the flag of Botswana has black and white, but it also has blue. We can't talk about why black and white are not used together as a two-colored flag without talking about two-colored flags in general, because we must also consider other combinations that are not used. When it comes to flags and color, there are six colors that dominate. Those are red, blue, green, black, white, and yellow. We refer to these as the standard set. Four of them are dark and two are light. When it comes to using two of these, it's always best to use one dark and one light color. There are 37 national flags that use just two colors. Only one of these flags, Qatar, uses a color that's not part of the standard set, which is its distinctive maroon color. Three of the flags don't follow the rule of using one dark and one light color. Those are Albania, Bangladesh, and Morocco. Thankfully, the remainder use one dark and one light color. So let's look at these dark and light color combinations. Let's begin with those that use white. There are 16 national flags that use red and white, by far the most popular combination for two colored flags. There are six flags that use blue and white and three that use green and white. And as we already know, there are none that use black and white. So what about those that use yellow? There are four flags that use red and yellow, and there are also four that use blue and yellow. However, there are no two colored national flags that use green and yellow, and there are also none that use black and yellow. So out of the eight possible combinations of one dark and one light color from the standard set, three are not used on national flags. So why is this the case? One possible answer is that there isn't a huge amount of flags to begin with. 37 flags is not a huge sample size. There are 193 sovereign countries in total, so only 19% of national flags use two colors. Let's look at the color combinations not used, starting with green and yellow. In our opinion, green and yellow often don't contrast all that well despite being dark and light. This is especially true when we have a fairly light shade of green and a dark shade of yellow. Take the flag of Mali, for example. While red contrasts very well with the yellow, the same can't be said for green and yellow. Here is the flag of Guinea. It's essentially the reverse of the Mali flag, but their green is darker and therefore has better contrast with yellow. However, we think the red and yellow still has better contrast than green and yellow. In our opinion, green and yellow is the least visually appealing of the eight combinations of dark and light colors of the standard set. Maybe others agree with us and perhaps this is partly why we don't have any two colored flags of green and yellow. So what about the other two combinations not used, black and white and black and yellow? Out of the six standard colors, black is by far the least common color used on national flags. So it's not that surprising that two of the combinations feature black. Let's take a look at black and yellow. While countries shy away from using these two together by themselves for their flags, these colors can be seen very often in other ways. These colors are very common on warning labels and also on road signs. Unlike green and yellow, there are no contrast problems with black and yellow. In fact, they contrast extremely well, and this is probably why they are used so often for warning labels and road signs. And maybe because of their association with these, especially warning labels, countries have decided not to use them as two colored flags. So finally, let's look at black and white. When it comes to contrast, no two colors contrast better than these two. Because of this, these two colors are used very often together from clothing, house decor, and writing with black ink on white paper, and of course, black text being used on white in the digital world. But when it comes to flags, no country has opted for a two colored black and white flag. But why is this the case when these two colors work so well together? Here's our theory. We believe it comes down to the fact that there's a certain type of flag that uses black and white, and because these particular flags use black and white, it meant that countries didn't want to have a similar flag. So what flags are we talking about? We're talking about these bad boys. That's right, pirate flags. There are many different pirate flags, but most of them have a black field charged with white elements. While many people look at pirates in a romanticized way, there is nothing romantic about the reality. Pirates of the Caribbean were ruthless thieves who pillaged from governments and private companies and often committed horrendous crimes while carrying out such thievery. When taking over ships, the old flag was lowered and in its place was raised a flag which more often than not was black and white. 
We believe the association of black and white with pirate flags is one of the reasons why no national flag uses these two colors without adding at least one more color. But what do you guys think? Do you think pirate flags might be the reason why we don't have any black and white national flags? What do you think about the other color combinations? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Click the like button and please consider subscribing to our channel if you like what we do on this channel. And don't forget to check out our other videos. Thank you for watching.